I was uh, in year three working for what was then a uh, top five um, or the, the big five consulting firms. It was Ernst & Young at the time. Nice. And I was in San Francisco and I was uh, on a project in Oakland, California. And I was riding BART back and forth with a colleague. Uh, we both, <laughs> yeah, many memories we both of lived. BART. Yeah, yeah, BART, right? And um, at the time, I was talking to recruiters because, as I always say, if you're in one of those large consulting firms, you know, you either are signing up for the rest of your life or you've taken your education and uh, you're going to go apply it somewhere else. And, and quite frankly, in a lot of ways, that's the model, or at least yeah. it was back well, They definitely know that too, right? PwC, Ernst & Young, I mean, all of those guys, Deloitte. I mean, your partner track or your partner track, and then you move, I feel like, right? And so I think that's to be I think it's true. They invest a lot of money, but they also charge a lot for you, and they squeeze a ton of hours out of you. So, you know, it's it's actually a pretty decent trade-off. But, you know, I, um, I confided in her that I was looking for something new, and I kind of wanted to move on. And she um, she opened up and said, uh, well, uh, I'm actually leaving this week. I just came to the nation. And I said, where are you going? She goes, I'm going to work for this startup in uh, San Francisco uh, called iDrive. And I literally said to her, I'm like, take me. Uh, That's awesome. And a week later, I had an offer from the company. Wow. That's incredible. <laughs> so so that, 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 was the, that was the dot-com age, right? And... Um, and a phenomenal experience. And that's really where, um, you know, I realized what my strengths were and what my, my likes were. And I've uh, been on that track ever since. 